Day 2020 is on. We are less than three weeks away. And as you know, probably don't need to tell you this, the airwaves are filled with ads that you've probably seen. One of the most fierce fights is for the 13th House District seat in Illinois between Congressman Rodney Davis and Betsy Durskin Londrigan. Tonight, we dig into the claims one ad makes against Davis. The ComEd scandal. Davis took $64,000 from the CEO, executives, and PAC of a company that admitted bribery to keep rates high. This one is confusing. ComEd is a power utility in Illinois, but it does not provide electricity to anyone in the 13th district. The bribery claim is from a court settlement over an alleged bribery scheme involving Illinois House Speaker Michael Madigan. ComEd's parent company is Exelon. Davis admits he has received donations from Exelon employees and PACs, but has not taken money from ComEd executives. The PPP loan debacle. Davis's family got to the front of the line for a million dollar payout. It's true, Davis's father and brother own several fast food franchises in Illinois, and they did receive PPP. And there is no evidence showing Davis had anything to do with his family getting PPP. It's misleading because there was no line, and to date, almost 700,000 businesses received government aid. And he voted to keep it secret, while businesses and families suffered. Davis did vote no in those measures, which did not pass the House, but the first bill listed would have only disclosed those businesses that received more than $2 million in PPP. Davis's family received less than that. Davis has stated that transparency provisions are already included in the CARES Act legislation, even if Democrats have called for more transparency. Tomorrow night on News 4 at 6, we will fact check an ad attacking Davis's opponent, Betsy Durskin Londrigan. Do you have an ad that you want us to fact check? Email us at investigates at KMLB.com.